So, now we just got enough money so that we can continue on with the story quest. We have to go pay an admiral, well, a pirate queen, really. We have to go pay her money so that she will tell us information about where our mother is. So, we need to go to... We need to go to... Here? Yeah, we need to go to here. Oh, I never got the, um... The synchronization point here. Okay, we're going to sail there. That's fine. Our ship is nearby. We'll fast travel to our ship. And then we can just sail on down to the pirate island. You're missing part of chat, some guy? Uh, well, I said hello to Karak, and then Steven said, do we have crack? And I said, no. Unless Karak has crack, but then, I mean, I'm not going to assume that you have crack. This game looks very immersive. I, I mean, yeah, it's a huge world. I'm not very immersed in this world, but there is a giant world there. Welcome back, Patty. Good that, to hear that it's fixed. I'm totally going to kill the pirate lady to get the money back. I don't know if we can GTA this. I don't know if I can give her the money and then kill her because in this game, you can't really kill quest givers, unfortunately. Alright, so our destination, I believe, is that island right there. Just got to sail over there. We all have cracks if you think about it. Yep. Very true. It would, would be pretty cool if I could pay that pirate lady to get the information and then murder her. That I would not be against this. To get my 17 grand back. 17 grand for a story mission. It's a lot of money. I think this is the right... Wait, am I going the right way? Ah, uh, no, that is actually a t level 25 zone. I need to deviate to the right a little bit. So we want to go, like, over there. I think that works. Yep, let's turn right, turn right. That's the island we want to go to. Listen, there's a lot of islands here. Zoom in. Well, the thing is, if I zoom in, we go slower. Because we're on oars. As opposed to sails. I can do some ship combat though if this ship is low enough level. No, 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 no. In this game, you do not want to fight people who are higher level than you. Maybe like one level, but if you go too much further than that, it's going to take forever to kill them. This game is just a bunch of. Um... Uh, HP sponges is what I want to say. Race! We're fine, Barnabas. We're fine. Is there another ship somewhere? No, it's the only one. Just point blank. Oh, I didn't even realize we could kill the captains like this. There we go, board him. Is our character a girl? Yeah. 
Hello, Rose. You can make a girl or a, a, a boy. When you start the game up. Get the hell off my boat. We got some Spartans here with us. We got some mercenaries. Nice job, Lieutenants. Nice job. Let's loot them. Get the hell out of here. Get off the ship, buddy. We're leaving. Oh shit, oh shit. Get out. That's okay, so your lieutenants can't really die. So that person's gonna sink with the ship, but they will respawn on our ship in due time. They will be fine. Where do I need to go? Where do we need to go? Where's our marker? Where the hell is my marker at? Oh, it's right there. It's behind us. Get that sail up! That makes me! Do you get to choose what weapon to use? Yes. Um, this game has tons of gear that you get throughout the game, including multiple uh, types of weapons. I only have a spear and a sword right now, but oh, I guess I have a heavy blunt. There's heavy blunt, there's heavy bladed, there is daggers, uh, bows, and all these weapons and stuff, or armors over here. Um, sure, we'll wear that. Hello, Book of Woe. Have I watched the Vampire Ghost trailer? Yeah. Let's break that down. Did I level up at some point? Oh, I guess I did. I have a point to spend. Hmm. Are there Krakens in this game? Not that I've seen. I have not seen any mythical types of creatures. What ability? Let's grab the uh, assassinate ability here. Shall assign that to that spot. I have seen that Vampire Coast trailer a few times. Rose, you were playing Black Flag for the shanties and were not disappointed? Yeah! Yeah, 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 yeah. I've been wanting to go back to Black Flag because of its ship combat. I don't know if I will, but... What's my opinion on the trailer? Oh, the trailer's amazing. CA cuts awesome trailers. Hello, Reaper. Welcome. Uh, the spear's pretty good in this game. It's a single target, long range. Pretty cool. Ready yours. Let's talk the ship. We'll make land for here. Y'all wait there for me. I'll be back. I need to go pay a pirate queen thousands upon thousands of gold. Have I ever played Rise, Son of Rome? Jesus. <laughs> have I? Yes, I have. I will not spoil that for you. What is, what is attacking me? <laughs> Something aggroed me. I'm not sure what. You have to actually find shanties? Really? In Black Flag? I don't remember that part. Alright. So 
synchronization in this game just unlocks fast travel points. That's really all it does. You feel like you're missing the meme about Rise? Uh, it's not really a meme, it's just... That's, uh, for people who've been following the channel for a while, people know my feelings about Rise. But yeah, I did a whole series on it, it's on my YouTube channel if you really want to watch it, it's like six parts. I played it all in one night, it was a time. The mighty not Spartan returns. <sighs> Here's your 17,000, God. It's ridiculous that you have to pay them so much. Take it. A pleasure doing business. Yeah, shut up. The information I need. How long will it take? I already have it. You do? Your Marini now sails under the name of Finikas. She started as a member of my crew, but we parted ways not too long ago. Wait, she's a pirate? Where is Hercules? Uh, there is no Hercules in this game. Hello, Lisa. Welcome. I'm leaving soon. Chaos is your home. But this isn't my true calling. My purpose. You might never find what you're looking for, Finikas. I can't stop until I do. So... You are a great pirate. And you are an even greater friend. Don't forget me. That's the same clothes our mom was wearing when we were like 12. The developers didn't even have her change outfits throughout the years. They kept her in the same outfit, but they dirtied it up a little bit. They put some dust on it. She's been wearing the same clothes for 10 years. Jesus. Do you know where she is now? She sailed southeast with her crew in search of a greater calling. Southeast? That... She was part of your crew? For a time, why did she leave? Much too interested in the politics of war. A waste of a good pirate, if you ask me. I haven't heard from her since she left. Chaos is a long way from Sparta. How did your paths cross? On the sea, long ago. In her, I saw a better life. In me, she found freedom. Together, we own the waves. I can't believe she was a pirate. She's the kind of woman who, once she sets her mind to something, gets it done. Okay. Thank you. I... Home isn't a place. It's the people you're with. If you don't find what you're looking for, there's a place for you here. Can I have my 17,000 back, please? Finikas. There have to be people who know that name. I should have enough information now. I should head back to Athens to see Aspasia. Yeah, so Aspasia sent us... Actually, that area sent us the three different areas, and each of those areas, I think, sent us on the three different quest lines. My god. The amount of hours we have spent on this, like, overall quest of finding our mom is insane. I have a cosmetic for the Andresta? The Scarlet Dawn? What? It, like, barely changes. Okay, sure. I don't have a figurehead yet. I only got the one crew type. Alright. Ah, uh, this mercenary screen, I still don't really get the point of it, but it's in this game. Oh, wait, 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 no, 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 I see, I see. So we're in tier 7, so war contracts and bounties provide 20% more reward. Blacksmiths reduce their price by 20%. Okay, so there's like a stacking bonus here. But how do I... I guess we just rank up by leveling up? I don't, I don't know. I've not been paying close attention to the system. I've killed so many mercenaries. I wonder if all I gotta do is track down this guy. And then track down the dude past him. So this is like a Shadow of War light system. It's not really that great. They have no personality. But they do have these traits here. It takes less damage from fire. It takes less damage from melee attacks. Okay. Um, well, 
for now, we can go back to Athens. Is that her? That's Socrates. Mr. Socrates himself. That's, uh, that's uh, a lover of ours. Where do I gotta go? Return to Athens. That's all it says. Okay. Oh, there we go. No, fast travel point. All right. Hide the photos. There we go. Honestly, I expected there to be a lot more copies of the Nemesis system far before now. Like, because the Nemesis system was amazing. I thought that was going to be, like, one of the next big things for the next couple of years with people trying to just copy that. But no, no one really did. This is, like, the first time I've seen anything remotely like it. And Shadow War came out five years ago? Four years ago? Five? Five or four years ago. It's a, such a cool system. But this is not that. There's no personality. I guess no personality at all, which is kind of what made it a great thing when you would see those orcs and they're like, Oi, you fucking suck. I'm going to beat on your skull for a couple days after I kill you. You know, whatever. They had tons of lines. But in this, these mercenaries literally don't even say a word. They just come in, you fight them, you kill them, and then that's it. The mumbler? Oh, the mumbler. Uh, wait, wait. Which one was the mumbler? There was the the best orc was the one with the like psychotic laugh. What's up with the slow time? Jesus, the psychotic laugh orc was the best. He just looks at you and just laughs in your face with this like Joker type of laugh. It was amazing. He didn't say anything. Seriously, this is a long ass slow time. It's not even loading the bar yet. I have had a couple crashes on the PS4. Alright, well, uh... I think this is crashed. Alright, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Let's load that back up. But yeah, the psychotic guy was one of my favorites. Um, the bard. There would be a guy who would come in and like sing a couple lines of verse before he tried to kill you. That was a good one. Um, what other ones stood out in Shadow of War? Hey, Malinor, how's it going? Hello, hello. You're right for the new Total War Warhammer 2 DLC? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am too. Vampire Pirates. Shadow of War is known for its awesome end game that felt challenging and rewarding. God. Oh my god. Yeah, I don't know. They had to have like just run out of money or something, right? For the ending of Shadow of War. To put like a 10 hour... Was it 10 hours? It was a long time. Of just repeating fights. Uh, the castle sieges or whatever for oh my god that was terrible mind boggling the hell was going through their head like yeah, yeah yeah let's release this this is great that game was a disappointment but shadow of mordor was a fantastic game
They wanted to force you to buy loot boxes? I heard they, they took the loot boxes out, didn't they? Earlier this year? Around the same time that EA took out the loot boxes for Star Wars? <laughs> I should have enough information now. I should. Back to Athens. Do I trust that this game will be able to not soft lock when I travel to Athens? Follow me, and we will punish this. Hey, gentlemen, all, thank you for subscribing to the channel. Thank you for the support, my friend. Please work. They changed up the Shadow Wars as well. I don't know what they could do to the Shadow Wars to make that fun. But thanks again, Jeff. Like the story of the main character. There we go. We actually loaded this time. The story of the main character from Shadow War was kind of cool. The thing is, because, like, the Shadow Wars was supposed to take place over years, right, in game time. But it never really felt like years because it was just castle battle after castle battle after castle battle after castle battle. And I don't know if they were going for this whole, like, they really wanted you to feel like the character. Because the character was basically just holding off the armies of Mordor on his own for years and years and years. And I'm sure it really felt tiring. And throughout time, you can see, like, it was draining him and stuff. But they shouldn't have the player feel drained. But I wonder if that's what they wanted the player to feel because that's what the character was going through. Because eventually the character... What was his name? I can't even remember his name. But eventually he succumbs to the corruption and he becomes a... Uh, the Wraith. No, wait. Not a Wraith. What do they call him in that game? In that... Series? Well, they are a Wraith, aren't they? They were just thinking, what can we do to drive to bad shit crazy? It did kind of drive me crazy. It was just so mind-numbingly boring. Patty, it was so mind-numbingly boring. Malinor, you're going to get EU4? You want to know what DLC what you, I felt necessary to get? Oh, man. Um. Crap. That's a great question. Nazgul, thank you. That yeah, ring race, Nazguls. Uh, to you, uh, <laughs> I don't even remember the names of the DLCs off off the top of my head right now. Happen here. Things have uh, changed in Athens. Uh, yeah, you definitely want to ask Lisa that question on which DLC is worthwhile first. I honestly don't know. Because I've been buying the DLCs over the course of like three years. I have no quests. Okay. Okay. Am I supposed to just walk around then? I see that the faction leader is over this way. That's Pericles, I think. Is this bugged out or is this just part of the game where I'm not supposed to be able to go anywhere right now? Okay. 
Best stay out of sight. There we go. There we go. Okay, so the quest pops. So it looks like a yeah a plague rolled through here. I can't find my mom right now, but hopefully the person we're going to go talk to will, will let us know where she is. Maybe fast travel will skip some stuff? I hope it didn't. I think this is just part of the game, because Athens did not look like this last time we left. Well, Phoebe's here. Cassandra, you're back. Got to run, sorry. Wait, where? I'll be right back. See you at Aspasias. Sometimes I think you are too much like me. Dude, that kid is everywhere. Friends, I know you're angry. And you have the right to be. Why do they hide in their houses and not quell the chaos that's come to Athens? Understand? Pericles is a sick man. Don't blame him for that. Blame him for bringing this curse that grips our once great city. We are Athenians. Not all is right in the city of Athens. Just gonna drop in here. Aspasia. Oh, Cassandra. You returned to Athens. What's left of Athens? The world we've built is crumbling at our feet. It's as loud as a battlefield out there, and as violent. They're calling for Pericles' head, as though he should know how to handle this catastrophe. No one is prepared for the end of the world. Ah. I came to talk to you. I found out some things about my mother. Her name, her ship... Cassandra, it's not the time. Pericles is dying. He won't see me. He won't let Hippocrates in his room. He only babbles about going to his precious Parthenon. Listen, I just spent hours going on fetch quests for you. The reason I came well, not really back fetch to quests, Athens but... was to talk to you about Mirini. Your mother will live to see tomorrow. My love won't live to see another sunset. I don't give a f You've had many sunsets with him. I've spent all my nights alone. <sighs> Pericles needs treatment, and the gods know he won't let me in. He respects you. Could you go to him? Mm. I could try. If you do, I will make the time to talk about your mother. For now, he needs your help. It's worth a shot. Mm -mm -mm. Pushing your luck, Aspara. You are pushing your luck. Kill her husband? <laughs> I told you. It's Cassandra. Yes. Come in. You'll let me come in, but not your wife? It's embarrassing. Someone so strong seeing me like this. Eh, that's a lie. I admit, you don't quite look yourself. I don't feel like myself either. I brought your drugs. Ah, yes. It's usually Phoebe who does the delivering. At least I'm alive. Though I can't say the same for my city. It's a shadow of what it was. Well, it will belong to Cleon now. He will have to lift it out of its sorry state. I wish to see it with my own eyes. Come to the balcony. Okay. Much has changed. I can't even stand up straight to look death in the eye. You'll recover sooner if you let Hippocrates see you. It's my time. The plague chooses his no favorites. I fear I've failed Athens. Its people, Aspasia. No, you haven't. Ah, you're kind, but I've lost. 
Aspasia needs protection, as does Athens. I thought I gave enough to Athena, but it seems it isn't so. Hmm. I should be out there, on the streets. You'd be overtaken. There are mobs, and Cleon's doing nothing to calm them. Thank the gods, Cleon won't see me like this. But that's all I can thank the gods for. They've turned on me. Hmm. The gods definitely aren't in Athens. I hardly recognize it here. It's like the Tartarus. Athens' fate is decreed. All we can do now is wait. You should go back inside. You need to rest. Where I should be is in the Parthenon. My greatest legacy to Athens. We need the gods' blessing. But Aspasia... Aspasia's right. She often is. But not about this. Yes. I'll go inside. Thank you, Cassandra. Tell my Aspasia I was a good boy and took my drugs. I will. And Pericles is on his way out. Now talk. Pericles let me in. He took his drugs without complaint. Thank you. Something wrong? I expected Phoebe back by now. Oh no. I saw her in the crowds outside. Did you send her somewhere? I had her go to Anastasios to see about a ferry. As soon as Pericles is strong enough, we're leaving Athens. We have to. But now she's missing. I'm sure she's all right. Uh, just tell me about my mom! Spasia, there's a plague. You've seen the streets. She's just a child. Give her the credit she deserves. She's more of a fighter than I was at her age. I told Pericles the cult is in Athens. It's too dangerous. The cult? I thought it was the sickness talking. I'm going to look for her. Where is Anastasius's house? It's across from the Odeon of Pericles. Here. Ah. Uh, just tell me about my mom. Now I gotta go save Phoebe. I mean, that's alright. Phoebe's a good kid, I guess. I don't know. There's not that many characters in this game, so I guess I gotta care about one of them. Uh, alright. Where the hell is... Where are we? Uh, let's see. It's in the southeast of Greater Athens. Okay, so down here. His house is east of a theater. Well, that looks like a theater, so it must be over here. Where's Phobos? You can't die. You're immune to plague. Come here. Move. Um, there we go. We have to care about somebody, Raja. Oh, shoot. That fabric doesn't bend back. It's a hard texture. Children are only good for slave labor or firewood. Now, come on, Rose. Come on. Theater. There you are. This looks like the place. Pardon me, pardon me. Oh, Jesus. Come on. The plague hit them so hard that they don't even have a face anymore. Hold on. What? What? There we go. Look at these fate like the plague. What kind of plague is this? Look at these fate. Oh. Look at that. What kind of
kind of plague is this? Yeah, exactly. It's like a bash bunch of crash test dummies. This isn't a plague. It's just a place where they make cars. <laughs> the developers are like, listen, we just need these to almost look like humans. There's no way the player character will actually go up close to a pile of dead bodies. Oh, Jesus. What, gods? what happened here? Speaking of dead bodies. Look at this. That's not even like a, that's not even a person. Hey, look at that. That's not even real. That's like, that's like from 1999. That's something you would see on the PS1. This was savage. Done to send a message. Demos must be carrying through on his threat. Oh, Demos, that's our brother. I'm glad Phoebe wasn't here. Hopefully she's... How do you know she wasn't here? Maybe she was abducted. Protects Phoebe from the call cards. How do I know where Phoebe is? Why do I have a quest marker? How do I know? Area yeah. not available. What the hell? You will not walk away this what is going on? <laughs> what the fuck? What? The Matrix is breaking. This is weird. I'm on fucking fire. So in this part of the game, I'm pretty sure they're cutting off the world because they need you to finish these Athen things before you continue on the story. But that is really weird to see just a gigantic wall in Athens. Burn over there. You want to get... <laughs> That's how people stand up. What the fuck? You want some too? Listen, man, I will kill everybody here. We are clearly in a video game. Don't you people understand? Look. Look at this. It's not real. That wall just goes up. It's like I'm in reboot and a game is coming down. I know our character, our actual character that we're playing as is sitting in an animus right now in the modern times. And I guess right now the animus decides that the rest of Precess doesn't exist. What? What? Hey, stop! What? Phoebe! Did they kill Phoebe? You're done. Oh my god. I would feel sad if I didn't see this coming 
a mile away. She was like the only reoccurring character in the game. Earth, mother of all, I greet you. It's still a little sad. Anyazu. Oh, hey, it's Socrates. Cassandra. And Hippocrates. Are you all right? I need to speak to Aspasia. We must find Pericles first. He's missing. I don't fucking care! Tell me where Aspasia is! Cassandra! Yeah. I'm sorry, baby. Aspasia went to find Pericles at the Parthenon. She should be there. I think we'd better go with her. I agree, my friend. I agree. Man. Spasia knew the danger, and she still sent you. I'm sorry, Phoebe. You didn't deserve this. You can always find new best friends. I mean, you can. You remember the ten other kids that I let die? Yeah, but we didn't care about those other kids, Rose. Phoebe has been with this character for years. Listen, it's a sad moment, damn it. Be sad, Rose. God. You think Cassandra shouting, I don't fucking care, was the most relatable moment in this game? It kind of is, because there's a lot of people telling us the problems, and I feel, I'm like, I don't fucking care. As, as me, as, as Tokshin, I don't give a, oh. There you are, Cassandra. Quickly, Pericles may be inside. What's gotten into you? Phoebe is dead. She's dead because you sent her to do your work! No, I... It's not true. Phoebe wanted to go. She told me she would be all right. And you believe that child? You know Phoebe. She wouldn't have taken no for an answer. It was out of my hands. Out of your hands? You sent her away! You could have protected her! What I asked of her was needed to protect Pericles. She lived to help others, Cassandra. She lived to help you. Wait a minute. You sent her out into danger to save Pericles, who is what, like a 60-year-old dude? When she is 15, maybe? I don't think I can stab her. It's a tragedy. She should be here. Of course she should. But you know the cost of living this life. I do. But did Phoebe? Aspasia, you're here. Any sign of Pericles? If he's here, he's inside praying. He refused to stay safe in the villa. Things have gotten even worse in the Agora. It's madness. Speak later and act now. Pericles? <gasps> Go! I'm going to destroy everything you ever created. Athens is mine. Oh, hey, look, it's our brother. Pericles. Well, it looks like Phoebe died for nothing. Out of my way. Ah. 
All is lost now. Ah, apparently he's dead. He was a great man. Perhaps greater than we even knew. We need to get her out of Athens. We'll take my ship. And then we'll throw we her overboard. Leave. Don't let him die in vain. Never. Yeah, so the brother, you can play as the brother or the sister in this game. So I imagine Cassandra would be a crazy villain if you played as the brother. But it's crazy because, like, at least for the brother, he really overdoes it. He's like... He's like the evil Star Trek episodes, you know? Like, he really hams it up as a villain, and it's a little too much. It's not like a good ham. It's a bad ham. It's like a ham that's been spoiled. I really don't like it. Yeah, overacting, exactly. He's like overacting as a villain. He's also not super great as the main character either, but I think he's better as a main character. It's just Cassandra is better than he is. But I call it a ham baby instead of a hand baby. Yeah, I, I call him a a ham baby. We have to move quickly. Stay close, just in case. If I get ambushed here and my lieutenants don't help me, I'm going to be very upset. Alright, we're fine. Well, his appearance has changed, I think, slightly as a villain. Like, I think he looks paler as a villain than he does as a main character. Cleon has ordered that no one leave Athens. And he wants Aspasia brought to him. I'm not going. Leave! Don't let them go. My lieutenants better jump in, because they're just sitting there on the boat. Friends? You're literally sitting- You are my crew! You're my lieutenants! They really didn't script you to fight for me on the- Fuck this game, man. Like, I can win this fight, but that's just stupid. My crew is gonna watch me fight all these Athenians when they are standing right there? Are you kidding me? I think that's the worst thing I've seen in this game. Maybe they want to see if I'm worthy of being their captain. That's not it. Come on. The developers just didn't think about this. Don't give them more credit than they deserve. And that's just a mercenary showing up. to stay, Cassandra. What? Why? My work is here. I can't leave the Athenians in the state they're in. You don't need us to protect Aspasia. Leave Athens to us. All right, yeah, sure. The city has been taken. This isn't the Athens you used to know. That is why I must stay. We must begin again. <sighs> You're sure? I have lived as an Athenian, and I will die as an Athenian. Then do something for me, both of you. Of course. Retrieve Phoebe's body. Give her a proper burial. 
Everything she deserves, and more. Thank you. Time to go, Cassandra. My crew sucks. And I expect to see you both again. Alive. You saw Socrates, hypocrites. The Crate Brothers. You know what Phoebe deserves? She deserves to be alive. That's what Phoebe deserves. Instead we get this lady. The farther we get from Athens, the quieter it grows. As though it's peaceful. But I know better. I'm sorry, Aspasia. About Pericles. And Athens. You have no need to apologize. For anything. Why didn't I use the Summon Lieutenant's ability? The Summon Lieutenant's ability can only be summoned when you're not in combat. It's a pre-combat thing. Unless... That changed at level two. I'll reread it. Um, I don't even know what she said. I don't know. I, uh, I did what I could. I did everything I could to keep people safe. No one thinks otherwise, Cassandra. The cult of Cosmos simply had a plan we didn't see soon enough. And they struck when the time was right. About Phoebe. No, allow me. Phoebe was my responsibility. I should have kept her closer to me. It was a Yes, you should have. And now slit her throat. I wanted to apologize. Yes, you should. Slit her throat. It wasn't your fault. No, no, no. Yes, you should. I'm sorry. Slit her throat. To the cult's credit. Okay. I'll make each of them beg for we're mercy not before that. I kill them. No, we're not. That time will come. For now, let us look to the future. Do you have a heading? I was hoping you would help me with that. Yes, of course. This woman, Phinecas. Her ship was called Siren Song. Phinecas. Yes, I know the name. Last anyone heard, her ship was docked on the island of Naxos. Then we go to Naxos to see Phinecas. Hmm. A new contract awaits me. Oh, shit. Sure. Wait, what was that David Goliath thing? Hello, Vladik. Hello, Chua. Get that crew down! So, what level is this next island? Oh, it's over here. Level 22? Alright. We can probably do that. I'm level 21. Am I still going to upload Valkyria Chronicles onto YouTube? Yeah, I... Will. Why is this game pausing? What the hell? I'm gonna get into some combat.
when we heard our names being sung out in the middle of the darkness. The song was so sweet, we forgot how to sail. Don't tell me. You saw the silence. I covered my ears to drown out the chants. But when I went to warn Garros, he was gone. I never saw him again. Please. When the sea calls, you never know where it will lead you. Garros might be king of some far away land by now. Never know. So our um friend there, our first mate, Barnabas, he claims that he has seen the Kraken. Our character does not believe. Isn't this supposed to be real-ish history? Listen, this is Assassin's Creed history. I, I have no idea. But I do know that at least Medusa is in this game, so if she is, then other creatures should be, right? Off my shit. This is like the best part of the game when your lieutenants actually fight for you. How? Okay, I kicked him. I kicked him this way, and he flew that way. What? Let's try this again. All right. Man, you have a lot of hit points. You think Medusa will be the only boss fight in the game? I think there'll be at least one other one. Maybe I should say... I'll say I at least... I hope that there will be more than just Medusa. Because they've shown Medusa. And... Oh, I didn't mean to talk to you. I just wanted to take command of my ship. You'll find Finicas in the villa at the center of town. All the city's business is conducted there. Then, that's my next stop. Have you thought about what you'll say to her? Uh, haven't decided yet. I haven't really thought about it. Well, I'm sure you'll have plenty to talk about. Yes, we do. We'll reach Naxos soon. We've had quite the adventure. Have we? We sailed yes, for a bit and we took over a ship. I don't think it's over yet. Where will you go? I have some business to attend to before moving on, and I have friends in the city I need to see. I doubt there's a speck of land in the Aegean where you don't know someone. You might be right. It comes with a profession, I suppose. And who knows, maybe I'll see you again. It doesn't seem that big of an island. Anything's possible. I'd like to know if all the trouble to find Finicas was worth it. Mm, I'd like to know, too. Are there certain factions? Uh, yeah, oh god. I was about to say. There are, uh, Athens, Sparta, pirates, merchants, and then these guys. These are, uh, mercenaries on ships. So they're trying to ram me right now. Fire! 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 
One's down. There we go. We'll board them both. There's the actual mercenary. Nice job, Lieutenant. Oh, you are doomed now, friend. Your lieutenants are dead. Nope. I mean, if you want to use arrows, get off your ship. Get out of here. I've not forgotten about the other one yet. We'll get to them. Uh, that Athenian ship looks like it's going to crash into them. Come on. So you thought it'd be funny to double team me, huh? Ahead of me in the rank. Good. It's gonna feel good to kill this guy. He's been hunting me down like all over the world. <laughs> You're on my ship! Get him, guys! I did not mean to knock you onto my ship. Can I knock you back onto your ship? Well, I'm not in the water. And the problem with AI is that they don't know how to get back out of the water. You think they would? But they have not been programmed to do that. Now he is dead in the water. But I would still want to loot him though. Nope. Don't go on the sinking boat. Just. There we go. Alright, got him. Swimming is hard, it is. Now we grab all the loots. 